separate results. It was graduation night for more than two dozen members of Career Source Tampa Bay's Tampa Bay Hires program. It gives people a chance to earn their high school diploma while they're in the workforce to further their careers. Spectrum Bay News 9's Sarah Blazonis has one grad story. This short walk came at the end of a long road for Daisy Marone. I was supposed to graduate like eight years ago and when I started um, I had my son. I was 17 years old and I had him Oh, just like very with us, sorry. I get emotional starting to think everything that I went through. Daisy says at the time, going back to get her high school diploma didn't seem like a possibility. I didn't have time for that. I mean, it was my kid first and then me. But tonight, Daisy was one of 26 graduates to earn their diplomas through Career Source Tampa Bay. She says it all started when she walked into one of their career centers. That was my intention to get work for my kids and um, they're like, do you want to go to school? I'm like, yeah, I want to finish. I never did. Career Source says this is the second annual graduation through Tampa Bay Hires. The program focuses on helping people ages 16 to 24 develop their careers. That can include earning their high school diplomas virtually through Penn Foster at no cost. It's extremely important. There are most jobs that will not hire someone without an a, a GED or a high school diploma. According to the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics, workers without their high school diplomas earn the least and had the highest unemployment rate among all education levels. <laughs> Daisy actually graduated last year, but wasn't able to walk in that ceremony. She tells us since then, she's also graduated from Southern Technical College and is now working as a medical assistant. It has really impacted me. I wouldn't have got a chance to go to college or have a good job. So for this to be my first job and what I get paid, I'm very proud of that. The beginning of a new path. In Tampa, Sarah Blazonis, Spectrum Bay News 9. Vice President.